Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to more 60 Seconds. So today we are going to start the 111 day challenge and we are going to do it with Ted alone. Ted alone with an easy little boy. And we're going to try it out. We're going to see if Ted can live for 111 days all by his lonesome. Hopefully we don't get any ganked by any stupid events like we've done in the past. Uh, oh, that room is empty. Okay, that wants the Boy Scout book. Let's get everything over to the side so we can run it. I didn't know that would break. Uh, we need to probably get the axe. So we're going to start way back here. We're going to grab these two things and... Oh, I don't know what else. We need food and water and probably the med kit, radio, and I guess instead of the axe. We need to have the axe. Probably that thing would be a good thing to have too. Because we will need to go out and about. Grab the axe really quick and the food from in here. Of course, food in the fireplace. Who wouldn't keep that? And now we'll grab the Boy Scout book if I can find it. Um, not here. So if we last for 111 days, and we have water every fifth day, that's 20 waters. It's the radio. There's some food over, or water over here. I don't think we'll have enough water to do that, so we'll have to get it from events. And we need events. In order to do the events, you have to have some of the items. So, we'll try it out with food. We're going to save a lot of time, but not rescuing family members. <laughs> Seems so wrong, doesn't it? Did I get, like, all of the water in the house? Oh, to the shelter. I might have gotten all the food and water. Let's grab some other stuff then. Map, that'd be a good idea. And the flashlight, probably. And I didn't make it, because I got stuck. And we'll try that again. Whoopsies. Blah, blah, blah. Nobody survived, you failed. Congratulations. Let me go, let me go. Ah. So we had six cans of soup, and it looks like seven waters. Or restart it. And I'll pretend like that one didn't happen. I'll just pretend. Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to another episode of 60 Seconds. Today we're going to play the one man challenge with Ted and try to last for 111 days. I did pretty good there, didn't I? It was like I did the intro again and you guys didn't even know. Okay, we're starting at the wrong side of the house. Uh, there's the Boy Scout book. Is that thing going blah, 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 blah. I don't think so. I don't see it. Oh, we can stay out of that room entirely. That's good. We're going to grab the radio, the book, and the med kit. That should be everything we need. Grab the gas mask and probably the gun. Because the gun is... Uh, we need defense. Oopsies. Broke the toilet. Okay, you can go. It feels so weird when you start on that side of the house. Whoa. That wasn't what I wanted. That works. Okay, I'll grab that. I can't grab the axe. Shoot. We'll pick up something on the way over. Good. So far, so good. We got a lot of water. I'm going to stay out of there. Grab the food. <laughs> Hi, Dolores. Don't worry about us. Nothing bad's happening. And grab that. I guess I'll grab the ammo, too. Why not? I know that ammo can be used for an event to get more food later on in the game. Okay. Grab the food. Grab the food. Grab the water and food. That's both food, not water. There's the water. Whoop. Okay, there's some more water in the tub. Good place to have store your water. I know I always like to do that. Okay, and I need that axe. Shoot, I need an axe. Well, nope, no, get in there. God. Well, we'll see how it goes. We got a lot of food and water. We got some of the essentials. I did get the gas mask so we can go out and get it once or twice on a calm day. I did get the Boy Scout book. Um, yeah, yeah. Should be alright. <laughs> Ted. The lone survivor. When fire rains down from the sky, it's every man for himself. <laughs> Our shelves are full of cans. We'll eat from cans, we'll sleep on cans, we'll even talk to cans. Plenty of water means we don't have to worry about that for some time. Excellent. Day one is always boring. Day two is typically boring. Day three, can't have an event. And we'll see what we can do. <laughs> He's already crazy. <laughs> Okay. I guess he he doesn't he doesn't like it when you leave your family behind. He can't sleep. Hopefully we can use the med kit to calm him down. Oh, this is great. This is hilarious. Nope, he's still crazy. He doesn't have anyone to talk to. He needs water to survive. Wow. Neighborhood's still highly radioactive. Great. This is amazing. I didn't realize he'd go crazy if you left the entire family behind. 
And I don't know the best way to make him uncrazy. Still strong contamination. Oh. <laughs> Let's just open the door and see who's at the door to begin with. Day five. He got scratched up. Ted was hurt. Someone started shooting at us. We closed it. Okay. That's weird. <laughs> he needs water today. Ah, oh, this isn't going to be good. He's hurt. Hopefully we'll get that event and convert the, the bug spray to medicine sometime soon. Oh, this is so bad. Stomach is rumbling. Uh, we'll feed him tomorrow. Still strong contamination. Discussing plans for the first meal. Didn't feature tomato soup when we heard yells from outside. A group of ragged survivors. Should we give them food? Or probably food would be better to give them. I don't have the medical supplies to give. Hi, I'm Ted. <gasps> you calm down. We got the map. Okay, neat. Ted is hungry. Great. He's no longer crazy. No longer crazy. Still strong contamination. Decided to peek outside for a minute. Oh, there's a. <laughs> there's pancake. Oh well, we don't need pancake. <laughs> He's crazy again. And he's injured. Stomach is rumbling. Needs some water. You can have water tomorrow. We'll feed him. You maniacs! You blew it up! I didn't realize that he would go crazy like this. He hasn't even been outside or done anything. Doesn't drink, he'll be dead. Okay. Highly radioactivity. Dreadful silence. Talk to the radio. You know listen to the radio you don't talk to it is that the first step to winning radio with us probably get some music you might have some nasty scars if we don't convert the bug spray still radiated anyone who can rescue us it's the government let's call the government on our one-way radio that's just weird even the the sock puppet has wrapping on its nose he has gone crazy. Government is not fallen. He isn't acting normally. His behavior is disturbing. Really. Knock at the door. It's the gambler. Day 12. So we have to take minimum of two people, it looks like. Huh. Gambling is a terrible habit. Time to ration supplies. Is he thirsty or anything? Uh, day. I think he can go one more day. Contamination is still strong. River designed it. Okay, we'll fix the leak from the pipe with the Boy Scout book. We'll learn. It's like in uh, playing a Fallout game. Where you, no, not a Fallout game. Some game where you learn from reading a book. Ted is hungry and needs water to survive. Okay. Oh, still irradiated. Uh, noises. Oh no. He's going to go even more crazy. That's why you get the axe. And the, I guess the flashlight's a pretty strong item too. Going to the tight. He's been calm. Especially weird noises coming from it. Giving us creeps even up here. Nothing still radioactive and nothing else. This is going to be not 111 days. Because he's injured. One day he's just going to keel over and die. The time will come soon. Not much going on with Ted. Still strong contamination. You maniacs, you blew it up. You blew up the barbecue. That is a mighty fine beard he's got going on. Oh, now he's really sick. <laughs> he should drink something. Ted got sick. Wait, was... Oh, he was injured before. Now he's sick. So we watered him on day 13. Could be risky. Let's do that. Radio could help. Give him water tomorrow. Nope, didn't say the end, so we lived another night. Stomach is hungry. Hungly? What's hungly mean? Ooh, army broadcast interrupted. Could we win the game as one player? I bet we could if we had all the events right. We still went and did it too. Wow. We left him a message in a bottle. That, that reminds me of a song. Genie in a bottle. Awfully quiet outside. We'll, tr we'll see. Maybe it'll get better. 
Uh, he's sick already. Why not eat the mushrooms? The end. Nope. <laughs> These were delicious. They're glowing in the dark. And now we are two for that matter. I didn't know that it had a positive. I don't... If we send him out, it's video over. Because he's still crazy. I want to keep going. I want to see how far we can survive. I don't think it's going to be long. We have to convert that medicine. That to medicine. He needs to drink. Uh, still quiet outside. I can't do it. Oh, boy. And the critters are going to steal the supplies. They got a can. Spiders got a can of soup. Whoa. What Ted did during today was really absurd. During dinner, he suddenly jumped out of his seat and started boxing the gas mask hanging on the wall. He appeared to trade insults as well as blows with the inanimate object. Apparently, he had mistaken the mask for a bloodthirsty stranger intent on stealing our tin cans. He needs to drink. Whatever. We need to make the medicine. I don't know. I don't know if there's a way to get him happy again. I think he's, I think he's a goner. Hmm. Awfully quiet. Band of people dressed up in green, shouting at your doorstep, claiming to take from the rich and give to the poor. I think we're poor. Let's see if we can do that. He's still sick. Maybe we get a med kit. Oh, he did. <gasps> okay. The weird people. And they were kind. Gave us a first aid kit. Okay. We're going to use that. His stomach is grumbling. Still quiet outside. We're gonna give it another day. Maybe he'll get better? I don't think he's sick anymore. He's still crazy though. Yep. A few drops of water. His injuries are healed in full. Good. Give him some water. Unknown wasteland. Uh oh. Oh, they need the gun. Are you kidding me? So we, we got that one done too. We're three steps in. We're three steps into winning the game. I think it's only four. Soldiers shouldn't have an issue with us. Time to ration supplies. Wait, Ted needs nothing. Seems awfully quiet. No, I'm not gonna send him out. Whoa. Screen just jumped. That was weird. It's like there's an earthquake in the shelter. Oh, that better not happen. <laughs> what did that say? Tries to hide it, but it's obvious he has a lot of issues. He has lengthy conversations with his sock puppet. Poor guy. Looking through the map, come across a few markings. Okay. Fingers crossed. If this doesn't say the end, we win. <laughs> now he's he's tired and sick. Oh, oh, that was the wrong one. Okay, we got the checkerboard. Stomach is rumbling. He's infected. Really tired. Let's feed him. Really tired. No, no way to send him out. I thought that was the event. I guess I should have read it better. I thought that was the event that we could... Uh, we need to go talk to the military. A few drops of water. Can have water tomorrow. Now we are actually stuck in here. In the cave. Maybe. There's water when Ted needs it. About to finish our dinner, knocking at the door of the trader interested in ammo. Let's give him the ammo then. Day 30. What do we get for the ammo? Can of soup. Awfully quiet outside. There's a lot of space down here. We can smell everything. Is one of the wall bricks loose? Okay, let's investigate the source of the stench. I'm guessing it's Ted himself. Nope. Oh my, he's drooly. We got another can of soup, that's great. Behaving very oddly. Fighting his inner demons? Yes. He's not gonna last too much longer. Another military, this is the one I thought that last one was. If I would've sent him, if I would've held off and sent him, we could've won with one player. Oh. Yeah, he went crazy. Ah, we couldn't've won. Oh, he just disappeared? What? He didn't even die? 
Ted could not resist the madness that was consuming him any longer. It seemed that today, following the advice of his sock puppet, he left the bunker and went in an unknown direction. Never to be seen again. We hope Ted and the cruel puppet that took him away from us will have lots of fun together. The risk is not worth it. What if instead of being soldiers, they're bandits or worse? We didn't make it. These are our final words. And our advice to anyone reading them. This is obscured writing. 32 days plumbing action. That's all the events that we got. New life with a sock. Convenient. Well, that was an interesting way to do it. I perished. Hmm. Yep, that was an interesting way to play. We may try that again later. Um, I don't know if they have a different social resolve at the end. I could have maybe played that a little different, uh, or done some things different if I if I grabbed the beginning items a little differently too. If I would have got a happiness item, um, that flashlight would have helped. Checkerboard would help too. So it's not all about the food. We can still go and get more of it, but. Eh, we'll try it again later. So guys, thank you for watching, and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.